How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games, and we are finally back with another Daz Watches. It's been an age, guys. Obviously, I was away surviving, eating my own shit to survive. Not, not quite that bad, but, <laughs> you know. And I was doing my Australian tour. You guys have seen the trailer. If you haven't seen the new trailer for Daz and Dave Survival 2, I'll link it in the description below. But enough about that. Enough about anything else. Let's get weird, all right? Relationships. For the longest time, I didn't like relationships. I ended up with fucking lab experiments. <laughs> it's, it's true. Happily engaged now, though. Boom. You want to see it again? It did a boom. And in relationships, we all find a way to balance things out between your, you and your partner. Some people like to introduce kinks into the relationship. Some are frowned upon. Some are accepted and widely used in other relationships. Other people decide to be fucking weird and putting on the internet on a show because they're getting paid 10 grand. I don't care, it gives me content. <laughs> Today guys, we are reacting to a video called My Husband Punishes Me When I Break the Rules. Love don't judge. It does, it does. It doesn't matter how perfect you think that your relationship is, people are gonna judge it and stick their nose in. Without further ado, it's so good to be back. Let's watch the video! This is Brandy. Brandy! Like the drink. Love a good brandy. She fell in love with Lazarus. Lazarus? Sounds like a game DLC. What's he? Is he sucking her lip? Or is it just caught in his? Yeah, if you're hungry, man, you're in the kitchen. I mean, ain't gotta eat your wife. We have been together for 15 years. How? We're gonna find out. Especially with all this yellow. Look at this shit. Do they love minions or something? Look, yellow, 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 yellow. It's awful. But this couple's secret to a successful marriage. Secrets on the internet. Oh my god! It's no secret where all the cleaning supplies went in COVID. Her basement. How much cleaning products do they have? Look at it. If you're looking for a dead body, they've dissolved it. And also, th their color coordination is awful. I know it's not important, but it is to me. Look, red ass washing machines, yellow walls. Oh god, it's like vomit. We have been practicing domestic discipline for roughly 10 I'm sorry, what does that ladle say? It's not a ladle, it's a spatula, but anyway. What daddy says goes. I've always, and I think I may have touched upon this, but if not, I'm going to again. I have never understood why men like to be called daddy. Even saying it, I can feel the back of my throat reacting. It's not sexy. It's not. I had a friend of mine uh, recently come to me and say, like, my wife does it to wind me up. I don't know if you can see this on camera. You probably can't. There's a spider lowering itself into shot. The nerve. Does he want me to tag him? It's not that big. Anyway. <laughs> Shit. What's going on? Mission Impossible spiders. That's weird. Anyway, and I said to my friend, <laughs> look her dead in the eye, right? And go, mummy. <laughs> God damn it. I can't do it. Hold on. Look her, look, look her dead in the eye, right? Shut this shit down and go, mummy, I love you. <laughs> Like a weird idea. Oh God, it's so cringe, isn't it? She'll never do it again. She'll never do it again. Promise you that. Gets a lot of people riled up. People can say, oh, you're abusing your wife. I'm calling the cops. We get a lot of- Just don't tell people. And when you're being led into a room like that, I know it's for the show and it's for like dramatic effect. Just stop telling people. If you don't want people to know or call the cops, stop telling people your private life. Woman is brainwashed. I'm about to judge, be the judge, jury, executioner, all right? What I want to know is, is like, how is he punishing her? Because if he's written in permanent marker on a spatula, it's what daddy says goes, and then he taps her with it. Is that, it's weird, it's weird. It's not what a spatula's for, but is it abuse? I don't think so. See, again, it's the US, it's always the US. When is one of these ever gonna be in the UK or Australia? I've never seen it. <laughs> It's always in the US. I love everything about my life. He is. Lazarus. Sounds like a rapper that never broke the million record sales. 
just loving in general. Loving feelings aside, this pair have a... Happy is the marriage where the husband is the head and the wife is the heart. What kind of fucked up animal are you making? And also, who printed this out badly and put it in the frame? That wasn't bought at a store. <laughs> He's printed that out, isn't he? I hate going to these shops. We have a shop here in the UK called Dunelm. I don't know if you've ever been there. And to buy a photo frame that doesn't have cringy quotes printed all over them is impossible. It's always quotes like a doormat. I just want a simple doormat that I can wipe, you know, my feet on. But they all come with... Like, these really awful quotes, like, Life is tough, but you're about to come home to your family. <laughs> or like, home is where the heart is, that kind of, that kind of crap. <laughs> it's honestly disgusting. I've been practicing domestic discipline for roughly 10 years. It's obviously not working because she has about a quarter of a million tissues behind the couch! What are you, what are you, like, what are you storing for? Ignore the discipline and the kink, right? What are you buying for? Your neighborhood can't wipe their ass because your wife's collected it all. It's a dynamic between two consenting adults where you have a dominant and a submissive. All right, so it's, it's, it's like a Fifty Shades thing. Okay, boring. Dominant usually referred to- The ceiling titty on the wall. A ceiling titty, I hope it don't fall. A ceiling titty at all. It's been a, I've been away for a while, guys. Let me warm up. <laughs> the submissive is referred to as a sub or a T.I. A sub is a sandwich, all right? As soon as you said that, I thought meatball Italian sub with um, Italian herb and cheese crust. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna get one after this. I'm gonna get one after this. That's a sub. There are consequences for not following the rules or not meeting. What's he looking at? Who is he looking at? He hasn't blinked this whole interview. All right, other than his weird thousand yard stare, he sets the rules, she abides by them. A lot of people disagree with this. Some people do agree with it. Some people think it's traditional masculinity. Some people are like, why isn't the woman? And in some cases, the woman is the dominant and the male is the submissive. I personally, right, I don't get this, and it, and it is often associated with females, where they just want the dudes to be fucking psycho and that's sexy. I remember once uh, I was with one, um, I was with this girl and she used to watch all these fucking crazy, like, serial killer dramas and stuff. You know, like, basically 95% of Netflix's library is, is like serial killer documentaries. And she'd always be like, you know, she'd be listening to the documentary where they're like, He tore up her body and buried it in the yard, but not before bouncing her head around like a basketball. <laughs> And then she'll be like, I want him to throw me around like a basketball. I want him to do that to me. You fucking don't. Why, why, why are girls weird like that? Well, you don't want that. You don't want that. No one wants that. I'm not even sure if I'm on topic anymore. The my expectation is that they are going in my mouth. They look delicious. All this mass food buying is paying off. And dishonesty. Dishonesty. Oh god, he, he has a printer, doesn't he? Life will be so much easier if you learn to control your tongue. A bad attitude will always lead to a punishment. Did I see that they have a son in the house? As well. Hold on, let me go back. Yep, yeah, there he is, look. He is literally sitting on that table as Shark Dad watches. And he's, he's walking around the house and he's seeing all these statements like it's okay to like make this your own dynamic in your relationship but again when like children are involved they're growing up around this and they might take it the wrong way there is no point in being disobedient you will not get your way you will be punished christ this man needs to stop printing on a4 immediately sequences being broken under the four d's it could be from these is that what you're calling it the four d's there's a category for that on pornhub spanking or writing lines corner time or just a, a stern lecture. A corner time? You put your wife in time out, like a dog. If I tried to put my fiance in time out, she'd roundhouse kick me in the tits. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. They all suck. I bet. <laughs> what about when he breaks a rule, though? I don't know. Even, even like people in a, a seat of power should be punished, no? 
at all times to my HOH. And I had to write 10 pages worth. 10, 10 pages? I didn't even do that in school. Man, this just, this just all feels wrong. And the body language as well. He's always, he is definitely a dominant person. She's very like, she's always like closed up and kind of leaning away. I just don't, I don't get this, these dynamics and why people put themselves in these situations. And sometimes if it goes too far, they don't really know how to escape it. Because after 10 years of doing this, it, I mean, you get desensitized, don't you? It becomes kind of normal. Dishes, cleaning the kitchen, doing the floors. Or they don't... Who, how many asses are there in this house? You have every single type of loo roll possible. Could be a nice table behind that couch, but no. I kept getting a book recommendation for a book called Spank Your Spouse, Avoid Divorce. That doesn't exist. Does it? My God, it exists. Why, why, does, the, why does the front cover look like a crime scene photo? What motel was this photo shoot taken in? It does exist. It does exist. I don't know why I'm getting recommended Five Nights at Freddy's and children's books alongside this, but that, you know, that's the way of the world, isn't it? Long lasting damage. It why, why, what is, why are the spatulas? They're tiny. They, they don't hurt. Spatulas don't hurt. Do they? The, the, I hope you know I do this for you. So you don't have to. Right, it doesn't have weird shit written on it like daddy. It's like, it's, it's so flimsy. Oh! Wow! They should rob banks with these. Why wasn't this in the GTA 6 trailer? Even lightly that hurt. I, I'm a bit sunburned, but... Wow. Just a little bit stings. That full force... Fuck! How's that possible? One tap. And already I want to go do the dishes so I don't do that to myself again. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We learnt today. We learnt. There's an enjoyment factor. Either you enjoy getting spanked. What? Why? What? Where is he looking? Why in every conversation is he looking off into the distance? He's like, he can see his future, but he don't like it. Well, I just realized I have 827 member requests today. I started the Facebook group. Of course you did. It's always Facebook, isn't it? I haven't used Facebook in years. I have it, and I think my Instagram posts and stuff still go to it. I'll have to check. But I, I, I haven't like written on there in fucking years. It is. It's just full of mums bitching about life. I love, it. I love reading the ones that are just like, ah, woke up today sad. Oh, well, just another Wednesday. And there's like no interaction with it at all. No one's fucking seen that, but they do it anyway. My mum once, I think it was like last year, I actually had to call her to make sure she was all right. She took a picture of a pond and a duck. And she was like, sometimes in my brain, I wish I could be that duck and fly away. I said, mum, are you all right? Normally you want to cook a duck and give it to me. Why, why you want to fly away? <laughs> Calm yourself down, mother. Facebook is for depressed mums and failed meta universes. People can talk, people can vent without worrying about husbands seeing it. Yeah, see, it's, it's for depressed wives. I, I'm not just making this stuff up, guys. I'm not just being misogynist, all right? Facebook is for depressed mothers. <laughs> That's it! That's it! More so than the people who be writing the negative articles about it. Our kids know pretty much all the ins and outs of it. Really? All the ins and outs of it? Do they need to? I don't think they need to. When mummy's bad, right, daddy gets a spatula and puts it in my bum. <laughs> they don't need to know that! Stop involving your children in your weird shit! I mean, there may be some things that people find iffy with the rules and how they have- Iffy? I thought that was a British word. It's a bit iffy, isn't it? Wait, when did Americans start using iffy? Have they always used iffy? Have you used iffy this whole time? Damn, we've only got shepherd's pie and crumpets left. They're taking it from us! All right, all power to you. Your kids look depressed. You need to like calm down. Thanks Razor for the new headset. It's beautiful. 
Guys, that was the first ass watches in a while, and I'm going to uh, be keeping them up because I miss them. Let me know what you think about these types of relationships in the comments. I'd love to read and see what you put. Like, love, caress my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay dazzling. Ha!